Moments with Dr. Greta are brought to you by the Ashley Clinic in Chanute, Kansas. Ever heard of cavities? Oh yeah, those are the holes in your head. Well, your kid doesn't need any more holes than they already have. But if you give them acids and sugars, those are the two causes, acids and sugars, your child may get cavities. So what are we talking about here with our food? Well, the acids are flavorings. Yep, you might be giving them water, but you're putting some flavoring in it because you think they'll eat it better. Well, that flavoring often is acidic. Also, the sugar-free substances that are found in drinks and other things often are acid as well, and this will eat your teeth. How about the sugars? Well, liquid medications, whether it's an antibiotic or whether it's over-the-counter cough and cold medicines, almost all of those things have sugar in them. So what should you do? Well, you need to take a swig of regular water after you eat or drink everything. Yes, that's everything. Because it takes your saliva at least 20 minutes to make the pH in your mouth the right level so that you don't have cavities. 20 minutes after you eat or drink anything. My goodness. So those of you who kind of suck and slurp on your drink throughout the day, you may be actually causing more cavities, even if you think that you are doing a great thing with hydrating, which you might be doing that. But so give that water afterwards and think about it in the wintertime here. We have a little saying for you. Take a swig, then give a swish and follow with a swallow. PH and sweet will eat your teeth, makes a hole that is hollow. So be sure that your kids are learning how to take a drink of straight water after they eat or drink anything so that they can have good teeth. And above all, give that kid a hug. I'm Dr. Greta.